It's the river. We're uh -huh. driving in the river. It said 200. This is this is the road. I don't want to slow down because no. Uh, no, I don't. It was. It seemed like our tires dug in a few places. We're almost to the town of Kerlin. We're gonna come out here and look around a little bit. We're right by the Wood River right here. Kerwin is about 65 miles from Cody and about 33 miles from Matitsi. And we know that Forest Finn is very familiar with both of these towns. It's taken us just about three hours to get here. This is where we've made it to today. It's in the National Forest and I think it's about 8,000 feet. And on the signboard it says, what is wilderness? Wilderness is a very special place that is managed in a very special way. What did Forrest Fenn say? No, he hid his treasure in a very special place. I've been wanting to get out here for probably about three years now. I was drawn to Kerwin for several reasons. Kerwin is by the Wood River, possibly in the wood. Brown Mountain is just northwest of Kerwin. Put in below the home of Brown could mean entering the creek at Wood River at the base of Brown Mountain. It used to be a mining town, possibly could refer to heavy loads. Bald Mountain is just to the northeast. In the thrill of the chase, Forrest Fenn wrote about going bald. There's also Chief Mountain, to the north of here, possibly referring to Brave. Chief Washaki is a really big part of this area and he's mentioned on the signpost here in the town of Kerwin. Do you think Forrest Fenn's ever been up here and searched around? I think so. I think he very possibly could have been up here. A mile up this trail is where Amelia Earhart started building a cabin uh, before she took her last flight. There's a few logs remaining up here where she built it. Uh, just wondering if uh, that has a, any significance to uh, Forrest Finn on that. Could that be some kind of special place up there? Because he was a pilot. Yes. Yeah. And this, this area up here is very special. There's no doubt. So it's about how long past this gate? It's about a mile past this it's gate. About a mile past this gate here. So uh, this is only for uh, foot and horse traffic past this gate. You can't drive. So anybody that's interested might want to investigate this more. So we've been hiking along the Wood River for a while. There's so many places that that treasure could be. I just don't know. I can see where this could be a special place for Forest Fen, but I haven't been able to figure out where all the clues fit together up here yet. So I don't know. I'm going to put this out here for anybody that might be interested in this area. If you can't get up here, maybe you can uh, just see what it's like up here by watching my video. So maybe I can help somebody else out. But as for us, I think that uh, we're going to take off now. Clouds are starting to form and we don't want to be stuck up here in a rain shower like there was yesterday. So 
Catch up with you guys later. Bye.